pilot facility, the Energen Corporation will escort mankind into the 21st century. And you were very fortunate indeed to be some of the first civilians to witness the wonders of split isotope fusion, a safe, inexpensive, and pollution-free answer to the world's energy needs. Safe and inexpensive, that's a first. Madam, I can assure you, this is one of the safest places on the planet. Do you say so? No other generator in the world can produce the power we are capable of distributing. Beneath our feet is the technology which supplies all our city's domestic and business needs. This is called the primary core level, where the convergence systems containing the isotope triggers are located, the beating heart of this miracle. But I'm afraid that level is off limits due to the proprietary nature of the isotope triggering technology. Here in the engineering division, you'll find some of the nation's finest minds keeping Energen on the cutting edge of power generation. Are you really one of the nation's finest minds? Roz, you enjoying the tour? Alex, I do appreciate you getting me clearance. It's just that, well, the tour's a little bit thin on content. I want to see how this stuff really works. Well, sit tight for a minute while I run these schematics up to the control room. Then I'll take you on a real tour. Behind the scenes, as it were. Center now secure. Travis, what on earth's going on? No need to panic. I, I'm sure it's just an exercise. I'm tired of your bleating, fat man. Now, put it down, please, please! <laughs> They've taken the control room. Now we have the power. Testing. Testing. How's it sound? Fantastic. Just like you're in the same room. Pretty nifty piece of design on Ross's part, I'd say. Yeah. Maybe we should check it out over some distance.
I apologise about the manner of my entrance. We will, of course, pay for the damage, but time is of the essence. My name is Kanin of the Energen Corporation. Your colleague, Miss Henderson, is in grave danger. Ros, what, what kind of danger? She was on a tour of our new isotope fusion plant when it was taken over by terrorists exactly 26 minutes ago. Well, is she all right? Is she a hostage? We don't know yet. This equipment gives you access to our HQ. Any contact from the plant will now come through here. We prefer to see people on an appointment basis ordinarily. Like your terrorists want to talk. You're in charge. I speak for the company. Energen has run roughshod over the environment for too long. It's time to make amends. My name is Pascal and I represent the pro-Earth People's Front. Our demands are very straightforward and non-negotiable. I'm listening. One. Immediate halt of construction of all split isotope plants. Two, announcement that spit isotope fusion is a dead-end technology and that you plan to convert all such plants to solar power. Three, dedication of next quarter's profits to waste recycling research. You have 12 hours to meet these demands. Well, what about the hostages? We, we need to know they're okay. You speak for the company too. Now you have 10 hours. The hostages will die if you make any stupid moves. And just in case you are stupid, let me remind you what else I control. She's killed the entire Metropolitan Power Grid. She's going to need some backup in there. Not many ways in or out. A momentary blackout. Please assure the Metro Council there's nothing to worry about. They expect to keep this whole thing quiet. What do you think that is? It looks like some kind of tunnel. Emergency escape tunnel. Still under construction. Nobody knows about it. You'd never get in that way. Security's on sea level. You might be able to re-establish a visual link from there if any of the cameras still work. And you're gonna need this to get around. Thanks, Alex. I'll be back. It was disguised. When you access the relay, don't forget to disconnect the positive contact first, then... Yeah, yeah, Beckett. 
If this isotope technology is so safe, what do they need an emergency escape tunnel for anyway? Maybe it's not as safe as we think. Like this lock I'm tricking. Let's hope the isotope triggers are better protected, eh? Yeah, this place is a death trap. Under construction. I suppose it might be nice when it's finished. Stairwell now. This is a four wheel drive, but nobody about. Do you know what it would cost just to think about terminating the split isotope program? My guess is she's not the least bit interested in split isotopes. What do you mean? Political terrorist groups don't just conjure themselves up out of thin air. As far as I can tell, the People's Pro-Earth Front never existed before today, and I'll bet their leader has never been on a protest march in her life. I can't find any record of her in any political group database, terrorist or otherwise. No. She's after something else. Sentry system, so those pathways will all be clear. Now installing the additional lines to accommodate the expected peak voltage for when the wave hits. Nice work, Max. Okay, fire it up. Lover. Travis. Power back on. Preliminary rerouting complete. Beckett, I don't know how they're going to keep this under wraps. I've got a dead one here. That means there'll be others. We'll get back to you. what I want. We're working on it. I was hoping you'd tell me a bit more about the pro-Earth front. Eventually we'll have to make certain announcements. Sorry, we're not interested in getting famous. Before we meet your demands, I want to discuss your surrender of the plant. I need certain assurances. That's expensive equipment you're playing with. Enough. Eight hours. Don't waste my time any further dangerous kind of poker you're playing. I wouldn't have to play these games if you weren't taking so long. I have to familiarize myself with every substation and routing junction. That takes time.
You took your time. Traffic. <laughs> Beckett. Found Ross, he's A-OK. -okay. Great news. Hey, listen, uh, these things work. Of course. <laughs> I reckon she's not what she claims to be. Is there any way we can get the signal to him? Name's Travis. He's one of ours, but he's not trained in control room operations. Beckett, she's calling someone. Use the cell phone hacker. I'm ahead of you. He's not done breaking down the grid segmentation yet. Well, we're ready. When it's over, we'll be counting little mountains of money. I'll be counting every minute. Lover. Gotcha. What if we were to find a way to access the control systems and electronically divert command of the plant away from them? Not sure if our terrorist friends don't find us first. How'd you get on? The person she was talking to is somewhere between Commerce Street and the river. The financial district. I think her motivations just became a whole lot clearer, don't you? We've got company. What? There's an open line from the security center. Eckberg. I thought you and your men secured this place. We did. Everyone's locked up. We've got a rat in security. Find him. They're on to us. This should lead down to the primary core. After you. Fluid reduces electrical resistance to almost zero. It's also 70 degrees below. It would have turned you into an instant ice cube. Cool. I lost him. Keep looking, Eckberg. So why take over a power plant to rob a bank? Well, they've gone to a lot of trouble. Which tells me one thing. They're after a lot of money. But there are dozens of banking establishments in that district. As I said, they're after a lot of money. Incoming. And who are you? My name is unimportant. 
Think of me as a negotiator representing certain international interests. This is a secure line. <laughs> Your seizure of the plant was an impressive display of skill and audacity for which I congratulate you. The people I represent have long held an interest in a particular element of the plant's core technology, the isotope triggers. Your actions provide me an opportunity to supply my clients with something they are ready to pay handsomely for. We are prepared to pay by... We got another player. Isotope oh, trigger. no. upon my receipt of the triggers. You think I'm in this for the money? I'm just a concerned citizen trying to make a statement. Madam, even concerned citizens need to make a living. Call me back in 30 minutes. You'll have your answer then. You recognize him? Martin Kolvek. Arms dealer. The biggest, according to some. How long's he been trying to poke a hole in your security? Since the plant went online. Which would suggest to me that your split isotope technology can be used in the construction of weapons capable of mass destruction. More than you can imagine. Oh boy. Ed? It isn't much, but it'll have to do. Now, if we find the right place to plug in, this little guy could be our only chance of breaking into the plant's network. The routing software I designed is working perfectly. Grid segmenting is now completely under my control, and I'm shutting down sectors with pinpoint accuracy. Good. We'll soon have all the juice we need. These are the 25 largest currency and precious metal depositories in the financial district. They're going after the banks. And with the power down, those depositories are vulnerable. No. Normal security systems should be able to cope. Emergency generators will switch on. Access to cash and valuables shuts down automatically. I mean, everything will be locked up tight within a few seconds. There's got to be something else. Ed, Roz, Pascal has blacked out every finance house except one. So that must be the target. It's the currency exchange. One of the world's largest banknote depositories. But why black out all the others? Well, it's more than just a diversion. I I'm going to get over there now and check it out. Yeah. All right, good luck. We're making progress here, too. Correct. I've located the control room's electronic subsystems, which could be our key to taking control away from the terrorists. But? I can see the subsystems. I just haven't found a way into them yet. You've had your 30 minutes. Oh, Have well, you made up your mind? Sounds like our friendly negotiator's back. Yes. We agree your terms. And it looks like we've got a deal. I'm very pleased that we'll be doing business together. How quickly can you disengage the triggers and bring them to me? One hour. I look forward to our meeting. This was not part of our plan. You haven't consulted your friend Lacombe about this deal. Our holdings include the entire reserves of several multinationals, as well as those of other banks the personal fortunes of seven royal families, and even those of a few developing nations. Do you think we'd leave anything to chance? <laughs> of course not. It's just that we at NRG... Yes, we've been hearing about the blackout. But Mr. Kaner would be better off seeing to his own problems, rather than sending out dire alarmists like yourself. Let me show you the computer that controls our entire security system. Just installed two months ago, no expense spared. State of the art, they tell me. It's completely foolproof. Lacombe, spit out some technological mumbo jumbo for Mr. Beckett here. Access to all sensitive areas is controlled by the network. These computers respond only to an encrypted series of digital modem commands and passwords. It's a completely independent network, impervious to outside influences, and minor power fluctuations trigger emergency measures. The vault's chamber is sealed off in seconds. Mr. Lecomte, 
Could I have a word? If you'll excuse me. Tell Canaan not to fret. We've gone way beyond locks and tumblers and key rings. No reason in the world to worry about robbery attempts in here. We've had a little visit here. Someone named Beckett from Energy. He's leaving now. You think he's figured us out? Not a chance. They'll be sending office boys all over town because of the blackout. Nothing to worry about, though. If we stick with the program, there will be no surprises. Guess the deal you made for the isotope triggers would be one surprise too many for him, hmm? He'll find out about that when I decide it's time. Seems your visit to the exchange has shaken things up a bit. We just got a call from someone there. We're only using a laptop here, so Ros's decoding is taking a while longer. Can you slow things down your end? OK, Ed, look, I've just had an idea. I'm going back in. Eckberg, why haven't you checked in? Have you found the rat yet? Eckberg here. Uh, I'm still looking. Just keep at it. Will do. Ready to pull the plug in the control room yet? Almost. But I'm still missing some key passwords, and I need more info on these software firewalls. My friend Alex would know just one problem. A big guard with a big gun. How long would it take you to get to where he's being held? I don't know. Five minutes? Okay, in four and a half minutes, that guard's gonna get a call from Eckberg, desperately needing help cornering the rat. Keep an eye on this. I'm running a code D scrambler, and you'll need to prompt it occasionally. Hi. Listen, I'm sorry, I think I dropped my pager during the tour. It's one of uh -huh. those annoying beeper things, you know? <laughs> it's always going off, drives me mad. I wonder if it was down here. Uh... My boss makes me wear it like an electronic tape. Maybe it's around here. You know, when it goes off, I have to check in with the office. If I don't check in, well, you know, there's hell to pay. Still, <laughs> that's what bosses are for, eh? It's not down there, no? No, no sign of it. Maybe I left it in the car. Well, thanks for looking, anyway. Be right there, Ragberg.
battery. Any chance for recharge? Where's Ed? They must have got him. Oh, God. we must complete this programming. Alice, can you find me a fresh battery? Right. Everything's set. Right on time. At last. Our little spy. Not talking. Strong and silent type. You were listening, too. Well, go on. Egbert's still out there. Does he work here? Lots of people work here. Why knock out power to the banks? Ah. Strong and silent speak. Well, you haven't made a move on the banks, why black them out? We've been building an immense power reserve. To use on the currency exchange. You've been taking notes. The exchange's security system is unique. This is the only way to crack it. Now we're going to put all that power to work. a surge so massive it will lobotomize the security systems correct all that data bouncing off the walls in cyberspace not knowing what it's supposed to do anymore now I see their plan they use the power surge to black out the security systems at the currency exchange, then use the generators here to send tiny bursts of current nano surges down the power lines. The pattern of nano surges we're sending now tricks the security control system into thinking they're getting normal commands. The online systems are thrilled to be getting the instructions again. They're more than happy to do our bidding. The systems that are supposed to guard against this kind of thing at the bank will now be brain dead. So no alarms go off, no security forces are called. Exactly. All their defences are down. Their vault doors will open, leaving them completely unprotected. Can't we stop them? Beck it's onto that. If you and I don't stop them removing those triggers, no one will be safe. To look on now. Just one more task for you. Remove the isotope triggers. No. This is not up for a vote. We're taking the triggers. That would be like lighting the fuse on a very large bomb. A death sentence for everyone here. Travis. Either we finish this thing together, or one of us dies right here and now. Travis. She's gonna kill you either way, man. Don't do it. I liked you better when you were strong and silent. All right, then. Let's get moving. Goodbye, strong and silent. can't just unplug them. The isotope triggers stabilise the fusion process. If you pull them out, all phases will go critical and the core will crash within ten minutes. Which means? Isotope implosion. Alex, that bit was left out of my tour. Everything within five miles will be swallowed up in a giant crater of flame. It will give a whole new meaning to the phrase scorched earth.
to clear out. Fast. Whatever happens to this plant won't concern you. Strong and Silent was right. How long can the plant hold without those triggers? Nine minutes, tops. Find Ed. Give him this. It contains all the control codes for the plant. I'm going after those triggers. Be Alex. Where's Ross? She's gone after Pascal and the triggers. There's not enough time. The plant's going critical. We've got seven minutes before isotopic implosion. Can it be contained? Slow down, maybe. We better keep the lid on the kettle. Come on. Final warning. Final warning. This site is highly dangerous. This site is highly dangerous. Final warning. Man, another inch to the right. I can never play guitar again. Hey. I'm on the trail of the money. How's it going with you? I'll have to get back to you on that one, but listen, if it all goes horribly wrong here... You keep driving. Look at this core level pressure's going berserk. If you switch some of it to the backwash units, that'll level things out a little. Four minutes, 19 seconds. No any prayers. She'll get the triggers. of power. Good, very good. The motor's running. Where's the money? At the other end. I kept wondering, how is she going to leave this plant? Certainly she can't go out the way she came in. Then it hit me. Energen's end of the world exit. Very clever. Why aren't you waiting at the other end? I'm an impatient man. Get in. Unless we reinstall those triggers, we're going to have isotopic implosion in three minutes. What about this cryo-management system? It's extremely cold, superconducting fluid. The tanks are right above the core. If we break them open, the fluid will run down and cool things off a bit. You hold the forward. For an environmentalist, you have a lousy personality.
time reset. Temperature reduction, time reset. Temperature reduction, time reset. It's working. Ed, have you got that power grid figured out at all? Sure, Beck. We're in the middle of self-destruct here. I've just been sitting around thumbing through an operating manual. Well, I'm pleased to hear you haven't lost your sense of humour. Yeah, well, with the control codes Ross gave me, I could activate just about anything you want. There's a drawbridge I'd really like hoisted. The one over at Central River Crossing. You know the one. Well, if Ross has got it right, I'll do what I can. I'll tell you when. The trigger loading system's been activated. How are you doing, Beckett? Yeah, I'm fine. But I'm afraid Lacombe just closed his account. I move Knight to Queen, Bishop 4. You have two minutes to make your move. Definitely the last time I let Ros borrow one of my bikes. The paintwork's been absolutely savaged. It was an emergency. Yeah, well, next time use your car. I don't know what's the matter with you, Ed. I can't see a scratch on it. Sorry, guys. Ros, I was two moves short of checkmating this chess computer. Dream on, dude. What did you do, Ros? Nothing. I think it was Alex. Alex? Thought everything was back to normal at the power plant. He's found a new way to send me a message. What? By interrupting our power supply? What kind of a dumb idea is that? I think it's his way of telling me I'm late for our date. Mm -hmm. 